Hey guys, thanks for coming back to my channel. Uh, I just, um, what? <laughs> you want to get in here? Yeah, get in here. Um, we're just hanging out. We just got done with uh, homeschool work. And we actually just posted a video on our Facebook page uh, talking about the things that we're doing for homeschool. And I don't want to... This, this channel I'm using mainly for bariatric surgery and my weight loss goals and things like that. And sometimes, yeah, we do other stuff, but, um, but if you, uh, maybe I'll post that video. Yeah, I might just post that video. Anyways, Aiden, CJ, we're hanging out. They just got done uh, with homeschool about an hour ago. It's going on three o'clock. And uh, I, I've decided that I'm going to start vlogging every single day has just become really difficult. So what I'm going to start doing is probably um, I'm going to take a video every single day, like a, like, a, like a journal, right? And then maybe once a week, I'll post them. And I'm just going to try to keep them short, what I ate, what I drank, how I'm feeling, what my weigh-in was, if there's anything to report, just saying hi, just checking in. But I want this to be like a daily journal. I kind of want to get back to that original daily journal vibe. But maybe I'll, maybe I'll post it, you know, twice a week, three times a week, every other day, something like that. But I'm just going to kind of maybe squash them into, so it'll be multiple days in one, unless it's a really long one, like this one might wind up being. Uh, so recap of uh, yesterday, and I ended the day with 116 calories left. Uh, Elise made lean pork chops with some mashed potatoes and, um, and uh, mac and cheese. And a biscuit, and I had a little uh, portion, about a half a cup of each, and then six ounce, um, or four ounce. It was a four ounce of the um, the the pulled pork, or the pulled um, uh, pork. Yeah, it was a. Uh, what did I just say? Uh, pulled pork. It's not pulled pork. I know. Uh, pork chop. Pork, pork chop. chop. I've pork never chop. had a pork chop before. You did. You had it yesterday. It was pretty I know. Good. That was my first time. It was delicious. I did not and expect so, it. There was brown sugar. Um, oh, hey, grab those. Gra hey, grab those. Uh, those new breakfast bars that I got. Can you grab those for me? Quick out of the top cabinet. Grab them both. There's two boxes. I started, I, uh, at least picked up these uh, breakfast bars for me at Costco. Or they're protein bars, but I, I eat them for breakfast. They're a little high in calories, but not as high as Cliff bars. And uh, they're in the boxes. See, they're the small boxes, the thin boxes. There's two of them. Sorry, that's, no, grab the, the whole box. Anywho, so I've been drinking my protein shake warmed up. Uh, and that's been delicious, like a hot, hot coffee in the morning, kind of, but it's like a hot cocoa. All right. <laughs> For some reason, we're having a hard time carrying two boxes. All right. So yeah, yeah zone, slippery. zone, perfect. Autumn. Um, and these are really delicious, like really good. Like I got to hold myself back from like eating more than one, uh, but they are 220 calories. We've got 19 vitamins and minerals, no artificial flavors and sweeteners and things like that. 14 grams of protein, not a ton of protein, but I'm pairing it with my protein drink. So I'm getting a lot of protein in first thing in the morning, and uh, which is really crucial and very important when you're um, getting bariatric surgeries. They want you to eat a lot of proteins and uh, less carbs, less fat, and that's, and that's what I need. For lunch today, Elise and I ordered some Pad Thai, which is amazing. Typically we get it from uh, this place called Cask & Co. Uh, down in the Frandor area, but today we got Noodles and Company. Uh, I wanted to try their, I haven't had their Pad Thai in a long time, so I got their chicken Pad Thai, at least got the shrimp Pad Thai, and it's a lot spicier than the, the Cask & Co, which I like, but I think we'll stick with Cask & Co because it's less calories. Uh, it just seemed like more homemade and, and healthier. Um, and then we're probably gonna look up some recipes on how to make chicken Pad Thai, uh, because I love, man, I love chicken Pad Thai. It's just so good. I don't know what about it, man, but it's just, it's the best. Love Pad Thai. Pad Thai and shrimp and, and sushi, you're like, mm, so good. So anyways, uh, we got the, I forgot to show you, I got the uh, the fudge graham uh, and the chocolate peanut butter. So we got two different boxes of those. So that's my breakfast. Um, my potassium levels were high. Uh, and we're not really sure why, but we're gonna keep an eye on that. Uh, what else is, yeah, so that's that's pretty much it. Not a whole lot going on. I weighed in this morning at 397. Uh, I haven't been there in about a week or two. Uh, I've, I've hit a plateau. Uh, I've hit, and this is common. This is something that, that has happened to me multiple times. And this is one of the reasons why 
I want to get bariatric surgery because every time I try to start some sort of diet and everything that I, everything, everything that I seem to do, if I'm not taking some sort of supplement, like diet, like weight loss supplement, last time I did, um, it works. And I lost a ton of weight on that, but as soon as I stopped taking it, I gained all the way back. And so, um, huh? Oh, you're cute. You want to get up oh, here? When did you get up? Come here. When he just got up from her nap. Wanna say hi? Oh, she got she got a little black dress on. Stand up. Stand up. Little black dress. Oh, she did her nails this morning with mommy. And I did my hair. And you did your hair. Turn around. Let's see those. Let's see your, your little piggy tails. You got two little piggy tails and a booty. <laughs> you goofball. They're red. They are red. They're did beautiful. Did you actually take a nap today? Yeah. Oh, are you? Pretending? She did. You can see the sleep in her eyes. Hey, Tiggy. Um, so Judah? that's pretty much it. No. Uh, weighed in. I'm still just weighing in at that 399. I, you know, some days I go up to 400. Some days I come back to, you know, like today 397. Oh, I had a salad too with my, my meal last night. And then, oh, we bought this, this quinoa salad that was uh, fantastic. And we've been dipping like tortilla chips in that or the pretzel thins. Uh, that they're really good. Both of them are really good. But man, you can eat a lot of those. And so you got to be careful. Count them out. Uh, I think it was 25, um, 25 tortilla chips is 150 calories, uh, and 24 pretzel crisps is 160 calories or something like that. And so you gotta be careful, count them out, uh, watch your portions and, uh, and just try to eat healthy. So, uh, tonight we're supposed to have, what do we have for dinner? Pulled pork. Okay. So pork last night but we're gonna have pulled pork tonight i'm probably gonna put that on a small bed of spinach with uh and like it wrap it up in a tortilla maybe with some coleslaw or something like that uh, i i need to eat more veggies and that's one way to do it um but i'm really stuffed right now like it's like i said it's going on three o'clock i don't know how hungry i'm gonna be i might just do a protein shake and a protein bar i've got about 300 calories left and that would be that would be it uh the pad thai was a little more uh, a, lo a lot more calories than I thought it would be. And uh, it, it didn't seem like a lot, but that bowl is a lot deeper than it looked. And I ate it. Something I've been trying to do is, is um, enjoy my food and then track it afterwards. And so I ate it and then I went to track my food and then instantly regretted it. <laughs> uh, but I don't like to track my food before I eat it sometimes because I just want to enjoy the food. I don't want to be thinking like, Oh my gosh, don't, you know, but I guess that's the point of tracking the food and weighing out the calories is that you don't eat too much. Um, and so, yeah, I, I need, I should probably, I should have probably looked it up first and then cut that bowl in half, but, uh, but that's okay. Uh, and I'm okay. I'm okay with plateauing. I mean, that's not bad. Again, my, my dietitian, uh, when I went in for my weigh-in, they said, all I need to lose is 10 pounds and I've lost, I've lost now 23 pounds. So um, not, not bad. I'd like to lose more. Uh, so we'll see. I'm going to keep this going. Uh, like I said, every day I'm going to, I'm going to do something and it might just be a quick three minute video. Uh, but I'm going to, you know, put them all together and put that out every other day or, you know, every three days or maybe even once a week or something like that. If there's really not a lot going on and then, uh, any activities that we do here in the house or, you know, if I go out and I do some walking or something like that, I'll try to record that as well. So thanks again for watching. I really appreciate you guys, uh, all of your comments, all your support. Uh, I've, we've got a couple of new uh, subscribers and, and I'm, I'm watching that number slowly uh, increase and that's cool. I, I hope this helps you guys. I hope this is um, information for you and a platform for me to, you know, just have a, a conversation with some of you and, and talk about, you know, the sleep apnea thing. You know, my buddy Rob posted on that and and, uh, and we're able to talk back and forth about how these, you know, these things work and, uh, you know, cause we're better together. And right now with, with COVID going on and all, you know, uh, we, we can't all be together sometimes. And so this allows for us to do that. So, uh, I'm going to continue to do this channel as long as I can. And then as we get closer to the bariatric surgery, the actual surgery, then the videos are going to start rolling in. I'm going to be doing like daily weigh-ins and, uh, and you're going to watch hopefully my numbers, uh, drop and uh and we're, we're trying to plan a trip for like august uh just elise and i to go on a honeymoon uh to 
Wizarding World of Harry Potter in Orlando. So stay tuned for all this. We've got a lot of stuff coming up, but right now it's just a whole lot of hurry up and wait. You know what I mean? I, I've still got um, tests that have, test results that, have, that haven't come back. I still got to schedule my consult and, and, and then schedule my surgery. So until then, I'm just going to take it easy on this and just send you guys, you know, just, just check in here and there and let you know what's going on. Uh, so anyways, have a great day and I love you and be kind to somebody because it is the right thing to do. All right. Stop it. Get out of here. <laughs> love you guys.